Greetings, and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky, and we have just finished researching personal laser defense. Um, and I think I want to set up my power suit in this episode. Um, what else have we got? Character trash slots? Sure. Why not? Really need to get some lights out here. Um, this is going... Oh, okay. We're actually getting a little bit low on these guys. We can add some more assemblers making this then let's get these modules inserted here there we go how does that work oh 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 we forgot to add stack inserters that's also kind of important well kind of important yeah really important okay those go this way those go that way completely forgot about that. Whoopsies. No, no. Out, out, out. Gotta have some outs, some ins. Okay. That should help with this process, I hope. It's looking pretty darn good. Yep, stuff is flowing. All right. Logistics slots, get some more. And see if we can possibly get things going. Um, what's going on here? What are we making here? Flamethrowers, right. Okay. Uh, one thing that I am thinking about... Wow, why did that get removed? That's weird. I don't know if we'll make any flamethrowers, but it would be a good idea to possibly think about it. Let's have no more than 50 made at a time, I think. This is it? Yep. Okay. 50. Now then, personal laser defense, I'm betting, is going to be here because we have a lot of lasers. Wow. 57 lasers. Okay. This is, is looking for stuff. Okay. Great. So let's have this made over here. PLDs. Yo. Hello. Where is it? I'm looking for the icon and I'm like, I don't know the icon. Uh... All right. I have to actually look it up. Personal laser defense. S. No. No. What did it do that? That's interesting. Okay, here it is. Personal laser defense. All right. Let's have it. Let's do it. And it looks like we're a little bit long on the belts or the, the blues here. F pick. Oh, no, no, no. Nope. I want these. There we go. Did it looks like we're missing an inserter here. That's inconvenient. Well, then. We'll just give it all the stuff we have and let this make some. Looks like we're getting... This is having a... Oh, was this supposed to be a fusion reactor? <laughs> I wonder what this is for. Is this for the power armor? It has... It's requesting engines. I'm going to check FNEI. What do we need? Let's get... Let's, let's look for this. I don't know what this could be. Maybe it's exoskeleton legs. I wonder if that's what it is. That could very well be what it is. Yeah, it is. It is. Okay, so this is going to make how many? Let's see. Let's try three. Or How many do I need? Like six? I don't remember. Three, six, some amount. We need bigger. We need a bigger grid. Oh my god, I'm still using regular armor. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. We were... The reason for that, of course, is that we were making the modules. And I couldn't figure out why these guys are not making. Why are they not making? Hello. These are two in this box. Why is this not functioning? Let's check the logistics system for this. Let's see. Speed module level two. There are none in the system. So why? Why you work not thing, huh? I don't get this. Okay, so if this is making some, it's going to make some, go on, proceed. Let's see what's going on with this. I've turned it back on to, to connect to the logistics system. Is that red thing, that dot, mean that it's off? Yes, it does mean that it's off because it's not turning them in. Why the heck would this work? No network in range. Well then. Oh, okay. It's in the five square gap. <clears throat> Yes. <laughs> it's just so silly. 
But the funny thing is, is it should automatically... Oh, oh, I have never noticed this. Did you... Oh, God, you can't really see it. It's now green instead of... Uh, instead of red. That's pretty cool, actually. What's going on over here? We have issues here. They did place the radar, which is nice. Um, I think we might need to get these all the way to the pond there. Uh, in fact, you know what? We're gonna get them all the way to the pond there. We're gonna be very proactive here and do stuff. Uh, where else? This one is okay to do with that. Sure. We're gonna get this thing hooked up here like that we're gonna get these guys grab these we'll take these off we don't need these power poles at the moment we're gonna grab these guys happy days are here again boom 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 that doesn't fit there and then we're gonna get these oh boy oh boy oh boy oh boy all right we have issues we have slight issues Okay, and then we need our our thing imagingies right there. We'll need one probably right here, or uh, maybe another right right there. We'll just be a little bit put extra stuff going on. So I think that if it doesn't have a network, then it should automatically go because it's asking for a less than, and it would be less than. All right, this is so slow. What is going on now? these hello greetings wow oh wow look at this getting all killed shoot that's pretty bad that's really bad we need more lasers and there should be bigger biters after this too we may need to beef up our defenses just generally on stuff like this all right we have where are these modules going where the heck are they going? Are they going over here? Please, please say no. Hmm. Oh, right, they're being asked for. No, 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 no. Huh. All right, let's copy paste these guys instead. Ah, it won't allow me to paste the modules. That's a shame. All right, that's fine. Let's put those in. Why, where are those darn modules going? That would be interesting if there was a functionality to see, and I'm not sure, there might be a mod that does this, if I'm remembering correctly, that checks and tracks to see what is requesting what. So if there is a box somewhere that's requesting level three modules, we would know it. Is it requested by power armor? Is there a power armor maker somewhere? No, no, of course not. <laughs> no, of course not. Uh, all right, so I don't know why these are being requested or where. I can only assume that it's probably something like a beacon that I put down accidentally requesting threes, or maybe part of a blueprint that might be requesting the threes as well. That is not ideal. I need to request them myself because uh, otherwise we're going to have issues. All right, we'll take these and then we'll take these guys, the threes over here. And then we'll start collecting stuff. I think I want to have like two of these. Do I want to have personal robo parts? I'm not sure, actually. I kind of like the nanobots. They're crazy useful. Uh, PLDs, though, we'll take. Take a bunch of those. Uh, legs. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is not ideal. Ah, these are all coming on the blues. Darn it. My my run speed is too fast. God. Uh, oh, we could do something else. We can do this. Aha. We'll be sneaky. Take the ore and shove it in a box. There we go. Boom. That way this one will be allowed to get those. We also have lots of shields gonna need several batteries too probably need more batteries let's let's have this say less than i don't know six what's going on here everything fine everything's fine looking good rots to the rescue the fish the fish still need a medical medical attention uh we need we need fish bandages um i 
I wonder if you could use a repair pack on them. Can you repair? I, I have to know this. I, I have to know. Can you repair fish? <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry. This is, this is a mindless detour of something incredibly silly, but I don't know if you can repair fish or not. And I need to know this. Where the heck did they go? Where did the fish go? Our favorite fish that we've been allowing them to swim in the ocean because today we're not keeping them in our pockets. Where did they go? Oh no. Oh no, wait, wait, it's up there, I think. It's up there. I kind of forgot where we were going. I think it's up here. Yep, the fish are over here, our, our damaged fish. Okay. I'm trying. You cannot repair fish unless it's a, nope. You cannot repair fish. The fish are destined to be, remain injured. This is quite sad, actually. Um, you cannot repair fish. We need fish repair packs or fish bandages or something like this. <laughs> KOS's madness increases. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> oh dear. Wow. Almost up to hyper module level 29. Look at this. Look at, look at the balance of the factory before both trains were waiting over at the other station. And now they're waiting here. We need to make more stuff. I think we probably need to start going for rockets. Uh-huh. Okay. Character log logi slots. Logistics trash slots four. Okay. You can, that's an infinite research. Oh, it's a rocket research anyway. Five, six. So it's not invent uh, infinite. Um, wow, look at all this biter goo. The biter goo is real. I think before we do anything else, I think we do need to... Okay, so... Oh, oh, oh! Look at this. There's... There's... They're, they're over here. Reconnaissance. We're sneaking behind the bushes. Hiding behind the trees. Will they see us? Hopefully not. We'll see. Do I have those, uh, modules? Yeah, I do. Oh, look at them. They're... They're sneaking. They're coming. Where are they going? I want them to aggro me. I'm staying a very good distance away. I feel like I'm at a golf tournament talking softly. Right. Okay, so they're coming up here. Wow. One hit and they did so much damage. That's kind of bad. That's like really bad. Uh, I think what I want to do is let's get some wall out here. There is no reason not to have a wall, especially when everything is easy for us at the moment. Um, we're going to put out a wall here for now. Uh, I'm going to change these guys, though. This is not useful anymore. We need to have better better than that. Let's get rid of these guys. And then instead, we'll pick up a blueprint for these. Wow. These are not being... No. We need lasers. Hello, lasers. Hi. You're not in a box. That's why nobody's uh, dropping you off. Okay, that's better. Oh, there they go. There all the robots are going. Very nice. All right, let's go back to what we were doing, building a tiny little wall here. Um, how much does this serve? Right from there to there. Like that, I think. Let's just check this out. Get out of map mode. Get rid of this thing. We don't need that. What is a range on a laser turret? We can go here. Just take a two from the wall. Okay, this does not cover those. All right, so this is what we need to have here. This is our pasteable block. Ah, this is the pasteable block, I think. Because they are a little bit off. You know what? I'm going to take them off and then just do them, redo them differently. I want to change this so that they're in within the block specifically so it's going to be easier for us to align the next parts of this like this so that the substations connect very important that and then we might even be able to just put in a, a marker geez okay here i think and there is that right no it's not right here over here. There we go. And then this one. Okay, so we're going to get rid of these guys. And this is going to be the pasteable area of this. I'm going to keep that blueprint. 
We like the labs, we can get rid of this one and copy this whole thingy majingy. That's what we need. Except we want the. We need to change this though. We really don't want this this way. We want to have it a different way. We need to have more of this. And then we'll change the direction of this guy to this way. Okay. That's what we want. Okay, let's get our blueprint going again. And we'll go from here to there. Perfect. That's what we want. Okay, and that's what we're going to get. Excellent. And we'll just align the wall segments here like this. Life will be better. So some will get swept up by the belts, which is a good thing. Um, and then some will be... Okay, let's get this this way. All right, that's fine. And some not. Wow, we need substations like crazy. And we also need roboports. This whole thing needs to be defended, so... Or basically kept repaired. That, I think, is the operative word here. That one there. Good. And then down here as well. Perfect. Looking great. This is looking very good. So then all of this is also constructible by the robots. So we now have pretty cool defenses, I think. Weird defenses, perhaps, but very kind of cool. This is going okay, I guess. And then we have all this disaster over this side. <laughs> um, I will go ahead and um, take these to a box. Uh, right here would be a good spot. Maybe just shove them into a passive provider chest where they can go and enter the network, get stuff going. Now then, we still did <laughs> didn't do our alien miners um yeah 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 it's okay we're gonna get there we're getting there right now we need gears we need electronic circuits for this um yeah this whole thing what we can do is we can we can start by simplifying this whole thing getting rid of the um turrets and then kind of Looking at this, and I'm thinking, huh, hmm, what do we need to do with this? I'm just like thinking about revamping the entire thing, actually. Just changing this thing altogether. Yeah. Just get these off here for now. Wow, we even have some ore there. Um, I think we can have our belts for the accumulators those need to go on the inner side here so that can be easily this way yeah that works it's not an issue okay put that one there copy paste all right, that one goes there, goes there. Okay, that is this. However, uh, what do these need? Do they need, they need batteries and plates. All right, so we can go actually take these guys. We could do, okay, let's, let's try sneaky with this. I'm going to take the output priority to the right and take only these circuits. Okay, and let's take those this way for now. These guys will need batteries coming on here from here. These batteries will come this way. 
I can actually put them this way. This is like real spaghetti. This is this is a master chef class in spaghetti. Is what this is, and it is delicious. Really? No. Don't. Don't. No. 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 Not allowed. No. No. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> it's an accident. Um. Yeah. This is this is tasty spaghetti. Is what this is. I need to move this up. I'm gonna move this out like this. Because this thing is going to go down. This is going to be the module maker thing, Majingi. We need to have these like this far apart, approximately. Well, ish. That needs to go one down. Or we could make. You know what? We probably should not do this. We should probably do this a little bit differently. We need these to be different. We need these to be the the drill makers. We'll have two drill makers. Or maybe with just one. How long do they take to make? Eight seconds. Hmm. I don't think we're gonna need much because we have these things going at plus 100% speed anyway. So that's one drill every four seconds uh, or less. In fact, we do need iron gears though. That is a little bit of an issue. We don't have iron anywhere nearby, do we? Hello? No? No, of course not. But what I could do is bring it in on this side now that I'm looking at it. Um, let's get this one making gears to shove into here. How many gears do we need every four seconds? 10. Right. But I think this is okay. Gears are made every half a second. We just need to make sure that we have enough um stuff added there so let's give this one this is going to be the mining drills then the next ones are going to be of course the module makers uh here alien hyper modules life is better okay um so this is going to go with that there i guess i can get ourselves a power pole Okay, and then these, these will go to here. Uh, it doesn't need to be that fast. Okay, and these will go in a box. There is the box, and we do need to get this guy going. Okay, there we are. This is going to have our, there we go. And this guy, this one is quite important as well. Okay, let's see how fast we can fill this. We just need lots of stack inserters to build this thing, but it should be fine after that. All right, and it's going to grab all the stuff. Now then, we do need an output for this guy. And I think we'll just output it into a simple box. We don't even need this whole array. I didn't even think about this. We should just output them into a box. But I think we'll be okay with this. Uh, let me just place this here. We want to say connect to the network and say miners. If they're less than say, we'll make 200 of them. How about that? That should be enough at a time. Oopsies, we don't need that. It's already connected to the network. We're missing the gears. So let's just grab... Oh, wait. Uh, we actually needed that there. Hello. Put it here instead. And get our iron. We'll just have a couple of fast inserters here for gears. Um, there we go. Look at this. This is still yellow belt. <laughs> that could be a slight problem. All right. Now, the cool thing about these mining drills is that I forget how many. Um, gosh, how many do they take? How many modules? Oh, my God. Four already. Let's just put this somewhere. Do we have any ore anywhere? No, of course we don't have ore. Um, not research speed. Just do something while we're. 
fussing with stuff. Let's see what we got here. So if we take one of these off, these take two modules each, but the mining drills take four. So what we can do is replace the entire thing if we want to with these fancy mining drills. Now they do cost more energy consumption. They're 200 kilowatts versus 90, but they have uh, better mining power or mining. They have mining speed one and mining power three. These are, uh, they have mining speed half. So you only need half as many of these guys. Plus they have this huge area of effect as you see. So what I think I would like to do though, is I want to get some of these mining drills with modules in them so that we have lots more productivity. So these have 22% and that's from our research. But if we add these modules, they have uh, 138%. So this makes a difference in how much uh, we do. Of course, they're going to cost more to run 431 kilowatts. But at the moment, we're not worried about this. We have tons of energy. Look at this. We're already finishing charging accumulators in the very beginning of the day. It is fine. We are doing really great. I think it would be, it would behoove us to get rid of these patches. So I don't know if this is the best place for those. Um, there's 6.3 million copper here. What I'm scared of is like, how the heck do I get more copper? Oh, there's more here. But are we going to like wall in the entire base like we did with the Belt Diva series or Tasty Vanilla? Uh, or do we want to have like trains going out into the wilderness alone, unprotected, undefended? Yes, and alone. Um, and then maybe I guess we'd have to protect the power poles, though, with little walls, maybe little turret things. But that's already starting to aggro the biters. So maybe it's just best to wall everything in anyway. I don't know. The biters are a new force nowadays. It's it's really kind of difficult to figure out, you know, what is the best thing to do with them. However, I think it might be useful if we did get some of these... Um, some miners going. Um, I think we figured out that it is like four of these special miners like this per belt that will give you a good throughput. So what I'm going to do is on the middle miners here, I want to just do the special miners. And I'm taking miners that have a huge amount of ore underneath them so on, on purpose so that they could kind of make the most of the modules and we don't have to kind of share stuff and whatnot. So um, what we want to do is just put down a miner, put down the modules, and then paste them in. So let's just grab this and we're just going to paste, 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 paste. I don't have enough on me at the moment, so they're going to have to be gotten from the universe, but it's okay. From the world, I should say, not the universe necessarily. But just put these kind of in the central locations for these guys. Um, get these two. These are looking pretty good. Usually the center of the ore patch has the richest uh, takings or, or the richest uh, spots, I should say. Maybe I should just even copy two together instead like this. That'll be easier a little bit. Just faster. Less clicks. Less clicks is always good. Boom, boom. There, there. And these guys are a little bit tough. Okay, nice. Now then, um, we have to have a way to deliver all of this stuff. Looks like most of this is in a construction zone, except for a little bit. So we'll just add one like right here, RoboPort, and then another one possibly down here to take care of this area. There we go. Look at this. They're bringing stuff, bringing modules already. Looking good, looking good. Um, I need more RoboPorts. What the heck? I, uh, I've forgotten to request them kind of important to our survival now. We, we love the robots. We'll have about 50 in our inventory if I can manage it. Let's go and have them bring stuff to me. Guys, yo, please. There they come. Good. 
26, 34, that should be enough for now. We'll go on over to the iron field real quick and do the same thing. Do, 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 do. Yeah, wow. Yep, 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 yep. There are, yeah, things going on here that are not ideal. This is going to have pretty rich fields, so... Get these guys, there we are. These should really improve things, I think. Really, really make it cool, really make it good. Kind of being a little bit sparse on these just because of the energy cost and also the module cost. We want to put them where they're most effective. Um, so it's nice to have it on a specific space. Didn't see that little bit of ore there. I don't want those bits of ore to escape me. No, no. That would not be good at all. Not at all. 57, 58k. That's good. What am I doing? I'm using the wrong thing. <clears throat> Nobody noticed. Nobody saw that. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine, they all say. Little do they know. These areas, I wonder if these, these actually might be even better to put in the modules and stuff on these edge places because we could make most the most of that ore in there. I am quite happy to have auto deconstruct. Um, so that these miners are going to get recycled, uh, as well as the modules, as soon as they are done producing. So, as long as we have the entire area carpeted with RoboPort coverage, um, this, yeah, we'll we'll have a good time, I think, with this. And it'll be okay. Let's make sure that that happens right now. Um, we just need to have, we need to have the the orange square around here, and that is so that we can get the modules in here. That's kind of important. Wow, that still works, huh? That's amazing. How's the rest of this? Is this all covered? Kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Definitely looks like it. Let's add this one here. And add a power pole there. Okay, looking pretty darn good. I think everything is in the green zone. The green is the construction zone. Um, we just need to make sure that the yellow squares are connected to get deliveries of different products. Uh, cause that connects all the way back to the main base. Let me just check this on our map. Just make sure that all of this again is connected to the main base. Yep. Looking good. There's a little bit of a gap here, but they should be able to fly across. It's not an issue. I don't think there's only a few parts in the entire area that is not connected. Um, and normally this is not really the best idea to make these huge robo networks, but I think we're going to be okay. I don't think we're going to be suffering too much on this. Do we want to get something over here? Did we not add this? No? Not yet? Okay. Got it now. Good, good. How is this going? Oh, we need to check on oil next time. Let me make a note for ourselves to check on this. Why don't we have lots of petroleum gas? Why is why are we not getting stuff? Is this just an issue of underproduction? Really? Wow. We could do this, make it better, make it faster. Um, how about this? That would also work quite well. There we go. Now we got some flow happening. Okay, I think that's going to do it. I think we should start to get some more sulfuric acid. There we go. Okay, it's going up now. All right, so we are kind of barely at a plus on the sulfuric acid, but we are still at the plus. Anyway, I think this is a good time to end the episode. Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.